Well, ladies, it's time to put your feet to the pavement for a worthy cause. We're talking about the 14th annual WMXD Sister Strut Walk for Cancer Awareness. It's this Saturday. Registration begins at 8.30 in the morning at the Detroit River Walk Resort Plaza. And this year, R&B singer Marsha Ambrosius will be performing at the first Pink Gala on the eve of the Sister Strut Walk on Friday. It's at the Pie Banquet Hall on Franklin Street in Southfield. And all of this is being led by 92.3's Frankie Darcel. Good morning, Frankie. <laughs> Good morning. How are you? How fabulous are all the women? So I had to come here to talk about this initiative for women. I love you guys. I do. Thank you. We love you back. Thank you so much. Thank so, you. all right. So let's talk about the uh, the gala um, at Pi. We are so one. excited. We maybe have like just a few tickets left. It is on Friday night. It stars Marsha Ambrosius. We just added Noelle Gordine as well. All of the money goes to the. Uh, Barbara and Kalmanis Cancer Institute, which we're excited about. Um, we're going to have a number of uh, initiatives going on, which kicks off. The Sister Strut is presented by State Farm, who I absolutely love, because in this tough economy, to find people to sponsor these great initiatives are important, particularly as it relates to women, and specifically African-American women and breast cancer health. I had my mammogram this week. Mm -hmm. I'm excited about it. Uh, my mother, mm -hmm. uh, Q, is 11 years breast cancer free, so I thank her for joining us and allowing me to use her story to empower other women to make sure that they take care of their breast health. Will she be walking as well? She will be walking as well. And she gets out. My mother, bless her heart, she's watching. Hello, she's 76. She comes out and has for the last 11 years, so we're excited, including a lot of women who are in the battle right now. I've met women who have lost this battle. And uh, so every year with all the stuff that we do at the radio station, this is one of those initiatives that impacts our community, that impacts the lives of women, and also that impacts an opportunity opportunity for us to really say how important breast health and your health period, particularly as African-American women. And you mentioned mammograms, and we want to ask people, there are lots of programs yeah. out there available. If you don't have insurance, if you cannot afford Absolutely. a mammogram, there are programs available that will make sure you get one because it is so important. And even if you think, well, I'm too, if you're at 40 or close to 40, you right. need to go in and get that baseline mammogram. Absolutely. And you need to know your family's uh, history as well and, and adhere uh, to that. Um, and for those uh, who may be in need, you can also call the Carmanis Cancer Institute because there are agencies, and they'll be at the walk on Saturday morning, so all that information is available. For those people who are uninsured or underinsured, uh, there's some help for you to come out on Saturday and, and participate and find out how you can get some help. And the $20 supports those kinds of initiatives that people are paying uh, to the Carmanis Cancer Institute on Friday, so we're excited. We're looking at some video yeah. of last year's walk, yeah. and we're yeah. going to be keeping our fingers crossed that it's not as rainy as last Can I thank Ben is. Bailey? Can I thank Ben Bailey? It rained the last two years, and this year it looks like it's 50-50. I'm going to say the glass is half full, but we're going to have a lot of sunshine. But if not, even in the rain, people walk in the rain for this cause because it's so important. And um, this is our 14th year. Um, we're going to be doing it. Rain, no snow, Ben. Horse <laughs> shine. We're going to be there on Saturday on the river walk, so we're excited about that. And how long is the walk? The walk is from, I don't know the distance, but the walk is from the plaza uh, to Kobo. We make that U and we walk back. And it's a beautiful scenery. You start talking and we're meeting people and you forget. I walked for the, I had surgery last year. I walked, I didn't even realize how far I had walked because I hear the stories of so many women and the fellows that are out. And can I say this really quickly? I don't, it, it's clearly to talk about African American women and breast cancer health, but there's some people that are listening or watch, watching. If you're black, if you're white, if you're Hispanic, it doesn't matter. Come out and join us. We want to empower and encourage you to come out and participate in this initiative. So we're excited about it. All right, absolutely. And congrats again to your mom. Thank you so Love much. Thank years. you so much. Cancer free. That yeah. is wonderful. Once again, the Sister Strut is Saturday morning. Registration begins at 8.30. And before that, the first ever pink game takes place Friday night again. That's at the Pie Banquet Hall on Franklin Street in Southfield. Thank you so much Thank for coming you. in. Thank you, absolutely, to, to be a part of this fabulous Instead of hearing you on the radio, <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back.